What do you think, John? I won't mind serving Bill's daughter at uh, my restaurant, that's for sure. Well, a nice shot, a nice panini. <laughs> yeah, you know. Yeah. Welcome, folks, to the Brother Mo and Bruiser Show. I'm Bruiser. And I'm Brother Mo. And we're here tonight coming from a uh, uh, friend's restaurant, a uh, guest. John Marcarelli, Le Perugino Restaurant, 277 Da Lucy. Come by for a bite. Yes, sir. Best in town. Uh, we're gonna be coming at you tonight with uh, ten wrestlers with hot with the hottest daughters. So we're gonna check this video out and tell me what you guys think. And we're gonna jump right into it. Damn good. Damn good. They're gonna boom. Oh Lord. The Combinator. The yoga motherfucker. Really. Twisting the banner still. Get a good gimmick. Piper's Corner, remember that? He's just a little baby. Fuck it right, man. Yeah, <laughs> he had a wooden leg, didn't he? One of the Von Erics had a wooden leg. What do I have to say? Well, say what the fuck you want. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know how you started. Well, I don't know. I, I mean, uh, <laughs> A lot of these uh, girls definitely had the fathers who made the big names and got them in there and all seem to be fitness instructors and uh, all sexy divas, right? I mean, uh, if you've got a sexy diva, you're not going to be there. And I've done a lot of pro wrestling myself and I've seen a lot of shit go on. And uh, I got I to gotta admit too, guys, straight up, my daughter's a little, little cutie and, uh, you know, she's almost 17, we won't go there. But I got, we're always going to watch guys calling and coming around and shit and so on and so forth. Mo, you've been in that situation like playing football. <laughs> and, and yeah, I, I, don't, I don't have any daughters, but... Uh, yeah, no, those guys, I'm, I'm sure. Uh, you sure? The kids, their daughters get a lot of attention from a lot of uh, a lot of men that probably most of those guys enjoy and love wrestling. And even though, you know, we all don't believe it's real, but it's very physical. And oh, yeah. You get hurt and this and that and whatnot. So uh, to see these crazy suckers spawn out beautiful children. That's right. Uh, it's pretty awesome, you know. Uh, that's about all I can say. I, I, mean, I, I somebody, think it's pretty nice. Some of these dudes are, well, let's be honest, a bit of a... Ugly motherfuckers. I mean, not totally ugly, not bad guys, but the wives must have been good looking or a gene from the granny came through. <laughs> what do you think, John? I won't mind serving those daughters at uh, my restaurant, that's for sure. Well, a nice well, shot, just... a nice panini. Yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah. Do a little, little, little tell you how to sing it for them. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, fix that well, hairdo up. Yeah, no, that's so happy. It's, it's not a bad hairdo there. Bring in a bunch more customers for sure. Yeah. That's awesome, man. That's a lot of customers. Yeah. But seriously, folks, uh, a lot of these guys are making big money. Some don't make big money, believe it. Some of these guys are as broke as uh, anybody walking in the street. Um, yeah. You know, Mo will tell you, we both yeah. broke. Both broke. Broke motherfuckers. Yeah, that's why we're doing this damn show. So y'all right. gotta fucking subscribe and uh, all that shit, comments. You know what I'm saying? We need so we, it. And links down below. And John agrees. Yeah, Big yes, John, come in there and come to this restaurant, drink a few beers, have a few coffees. You're Perugino, 277 Da Lucy, Ottawa. Come and check us out. That's it. We'll come back at you next week with some more videos and comments and everything. And controversy. Absolutely. I love the fucking controversy. Bruiser. Ah. Got Boom. the big boys in the show. Brother Mo. <laughs>